right guys, I am still in Mishawaka, Indiana right here. And I just drove past this place. I thought it was a big grocery store because on the side here, that's basically what it looks like. Check this out. Look at this, it says town and country, convenient and friendly shopping. So I thought this was a grocery store, but it turns out apparently this uh, shopping center itself is called town and country. And when I came around the front here, I noticed a big label scar, and this is actually a former Big Lots. Check it out. Look at this, you can see the label scar up there where it says Big Lots. I thought it was a grocery store, and I bet it was at one time because that's just the way that it looks to me. Let's go see if we can see anything in the windows. All right. Yeah, I can almost guarantee this was a grocery store at one time. That's just how the layout looks to me. You can see a little bit in here. There's a little bit of a reflection, but you can see where there used to be uh, shelving. Looks like it was backed right up against the doors here. Let's go look through these windows in the front. Yeah, look at that. Big wide open space in there. this down here greeting card or something still got their flag up at least yeah look at that that's where all the shelves were it always amazes me how uh, how the shelves get all that gunk under them like anytime anything leaks in these stores it all runs underneath the shelves and you never see it again until they take the shelves out all right let's go down here and check out these not much to see at the doors actually but they probably had carts in here oh yeah here we go big lots thank you for your patronage please come see the new store on march 1st yep here we go. Oh, look at that. That leads into another area there. That's something else that tells me that this was a grocery store. I bet this is the part that it leads into right here. Yep. Well, that's kind of cool. I didn't know that was a big lot until I got up here and saw that label scar. There it is. All right, I'm out of here.